waited and waited on the 15th for the signal from Bob Schranzer. Everything was set for Valkyrie. Paris, Vienna, Berlin. Everywhere, full alert. You were right there by the Führer's elbow. But why didn't you do it? Himmler never arrived, so I didn't fuse the bomb. Next Führer conference is day after tomorrow. That's the 20th. Yes. July 20th. Now, what's this meeting with the General von Beck about? I don't know, but he says it's very urgent. You have lost your last chance. Why? I'm going there again. Then you haven't heard. Heard what? Roman. He has been badly wounded. He may be dead by now. You should have done it when we still had Roma. Now what? Xavius. It's good, lady. Yes. Good. Glad you're here. My informant in the Gestapo just told me not 15 minutes ago that a warrant is being processed for your arrest. It's no more than I expected for months. And that settles it. The whole thing is unraveling. Two days from now, we'll be living in a different society. A free Germany. How can you proceed without Rommel? Once you hold in, can you withstand the Gestapo interrogation? The whole enterprise hangs by a hair. We've crossed the Rubicon. It's our last chance. Rommel or no Rommel. On July 20th, I'll kill him. And the curie goes. Your paper, please. Thank you. Good to see you. Come into the office. I'm joined the map room at one. Are you ready to notify our people in Berlin? Yes. What about the others? Our telephone, telegraph and radio communications will be cut immediately after. How much time have you given yourself? Ten minutes. Too short. The shorter the fuse, the shorter the risk of the bomb being discovered. But when will you set it? Right before I begin. 
You know Himmler and Göring, they won't be at the meeting. Yeah. No matter. But Rohn. Rohn has just returned from Berlin. He will be there. Yes, I know. But it can't be helped. Fergie. This will be Germany's greatest day. Now I'm to report to Keitel's quarters. It's a good thing you're early, Stauffenberg. The Führer's conference has been put forward to 12.30. Yes, Mussolini will arrive by train at 2.30. So military matters will have to be sped along. You're requested to make your report a brief one. I will notify you exactly when I want you to give it. Are you ready? Come along, Stauffenberg. It is time. Certainly, Feldmarschall. All right, von Jol. Hello, Mr. Colonel. Uh, no, thank you, thank you. Just a moment, Feldmarschall. I'm out of uniform. I forgot my cap. I'm expecting an urgent call from my Berlin office. Important information for the Führer. You will summon me immediately when the call comes. Yeah, I always stop back. Zur Mobilisierung der Kampf- und Arbeitskräfte im ländlichen Raum hat General Dank das folgenden Aufruf verlassen. Mein Führer, Oberst Graf Stauffenberg has a very fine report to make on the Home Army Divisions for East Prussia. Zurück zum Aufruf von General Dank als mein Führer, damit Sie sehen, dass unsere Verbündeten sich auf das deutsche Heer verlassen können. Volksgenossen und Volksgenossinnen, der Aufruf von General Jeckel am 16. Juli ist ein überzeugender Beweis, dass in diesem Augenblick der Gefahr das lettische Volk nicht allein dasteht, dass uns die heldenhafte deutsche Wehrmacht schützt und bis zum letzten verteidigen wird. Die deutsche Wehrmacht, die uns schon vor drei Jahren vom Joch der Bolschewisten befreit hat. Der Führer Großdeutschlands hat befohlen, den baltischen Raum zu befestigen und dazu alle Kräfte zu mobilisieren. Daher werden schon in den nächsten Tagen alle waffenfähigen Männer zum Schutz und zur Sicherung der Grenzen unseres Landes einberufen. Und viele Frauen und Männer werden zur Errichtung eines Schutzwalles um unser Land eingesetzt werden. Diese totale Mobilmachung unseres Volkes wird unser ganzes Leben in weitem Maße berühren. Und Behörden, Betrieben, überall werden die Arbeiten auf das Mindestmaß herabgesetzt werden, um Kräfte zum Schutz des Vaterlandes freizumachen. How long? A little under three minutes. Nordöstlich des Ladoga Sees gab es hauptsächlich beiderseitige Spätdrucktätigkeit. Östlich von Uxu Yarvi wurden die mit schweren Waffen unterstützten feindlichen Angriffe abgewehrt oder feindliche Abteilungen schon in der Bereitstellung zersprengt. Im Gelände zwischen Loimol Yarvi und Suyo Yarvi dauerten die wechselvollen Kämpfe an. Eine Verstärkung unserer Truppe in diesen Regionen ist zurzeit nicht nötig. Wie lange unsere Truppen in der Stellung sind? Oberscharfführer, 
Oberst Graf Stauffenberg. Have you seen him? Yes, sir, Feld Marshal. He left the building not a moment ago. Westlich von der Dwina. Seine Vorhut ist schon bis südöstlich von Dunaburg vorgedrungen. Hier. Wenn wir uns beim Papus sehen, nicht sofort zurückziehen, ist eine Katastrophe nicht zu vermeiden. The Antichrist is dead. Fergibel, quickly. Berlin now, but Kür is on. Tell them on the way. Driver! What's the meaning of this? Raise that barrier! Can't you see what's happened back there? This is urgent Führer business! I'm sorry, sir. No one passes until I have authorization. Then you shall have it. Colonel Stauffenberg here, Captain. They're trying to prevent me from passing the first checkpoint. Yes. Yes, I appreciate it. Thank you, Captain. Thanks. Lieutenant, you've heard. I'm allowed to pass. Raise the barrier. Lieutenant, the barrier! Raise the barrier! Thank you, Lieutenant. Now you will be good enough to notify the other checkpoints of our approach. Driver. Who was that on the telephone? No one. I'm to be allowed through. Urgent Führer business in Berlin. I am sorry, Oberst. I have orders that no one to leave the compound. Your telephone, Scharführer. Mölndorf, this is Oberst Stauffenberg. General Fromm is waiting for me at the airfield. Urgent Führer business in Berlin. Are we allowed to pass checkpoint three? Yes. Yes, thank you, Hauptmann. Thank you. You heard Schauspieler. We're allowed through. Excuse me, please, Oberst. But I will have to call Hauptmann von Mollendorf myself. Very well, Schauspieler. By all means, call him. What are we going to do? Quiet. Hauptmann von Mollendorf, this is Schauführer Kobe at checkpoint three. 
Is Ove Stauffenberger allowed to pass? Thank you. Obest, you are authorized to pass. Thank you, Scharfuhrer. Raise the barrier. But you weren't talking to anyone. This time I was. Mein Führer, I came as soon as I could. Morel? Nothing serious, Herr Reichsmarschall, but you must speak up. He sees have been slightly injured. What happened? A bomb. A criminal conspiracy, Göring. They're all hang like butchered cattle. Who did it? That crippled colonel. With a briefcase bomb. And escaped to the airfield. Stauffenberg? Ah, can you believe it? The alarm is out for him. We'll get him. We'll get them all. Now I've got them where I want them. Now I can act. But, but such a thing at... At our own headquarters. It is a turn of fate. After this miracle of my survival, it is inconceivable that our cause should meet with misfortune. Hmm. It will rally the people to me like nothing else. And it frees my hands. Prepare a list, Göring, of those who will die. With the news that Hitler escaped serious injury and is still in command, the Stauffenberg conspiracy quickly fizzles and the Berlin uprising is crushed. That same night, after a few hours of aborted activity and multiple bungling, Stauffenberg and some of the others are apprehended. Sentenced to death by an instant kangaroo court, they will be summarily executed. begins the bloodbath. Adolf Hitler will slaughter all surviving opposition. More than 5,000 Germans, most of them innocent, including the last remnants of the old aristocracy, like Count Klaus Schenk von Stauffenberg.